Just got home from work. I actually had a pretty good Monday. Quite productive. Hope you did too. Uh, came home to this from C. Reisner Cutlery. I'm very, very excited. That's traditional pocket knives. Going to use my Ohio River Jack Warncliffe. Oh, I'm excited. I'm going to be receiving a pocket slip from Kevin Duty shortly. Made of leather. Can't wait for this knife here. But this one is new. You know what it is. The USS Lake Champlain. So this is the Lake Champlain Jack I'm getting. That is an aircraft carrier. That I guess that's the generation before the current generation, if I'm not mistaken. They're all named after presidents these days, the super carriers. That is so cool. So um, uh, Austin of uh, Traditional Pocket Knives, his grandfather served on this ship. And so this knife is a um, tribute to that. Oh, look how cool. Sorry. Slow down, Bob. Slow down. It's not going anywhere. So look at all the stickers he sends. Stickers and patch. It's very cool. All right. I'm excited about this. Single blade clip point with green micarta. I know this to be a big knife. What a great box. I know this to be a big knife, so I'm excited and interested. Oh, he gets. Let's see. There's the Ohio River Jack. Whoa. Smooth. All right, let's just do this. Uh, OEM'd by QSP, Ooh, feels really nicely done, very well hafted, perfectly centered. That's titanium, that single flute. Oh man, and that is a beautiful big clip point blade. That's a three and a half inch blade. Um, I am going to compare it to this now. Okay, let's see. That's substantially larger than the Ohio River Jack. Wow, this is beautiful. Whoa. Oh, ooh. That action. Mm. And that is really nice micarta. Very nicely fit. All right, um, let us see here. Put this to the side. I'm going to get a piece of paper just to see. I'm sure it's really, really dull. So I don't want to stress out this M390 blade at all, but let me try. Let's see. Oh, yeah. Slips between the molecules. Wow. Man. I know it's not for this, but... Oh yeah, great back cut on this too. If you happen to get into a Bowie knife fight and you have this on you and um, and you're really, 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 really good, you could use this uh, swedge for a back cut, but you might wanna duct tape the pivot so it doesn't fold on you. But that none of that is uh, covered in the warranty, so don't even think about it. Oh my God, this has me giddy. This is a really, really sweet knife. It also comes in a, not a Warren Cliff, but a sheep's foot. And uh, that's also uh, much beloved. I've seen a lot of videos of that. Uh, I am loving this clip. The uh, video got cut off, uh, but I was just finishing by saying I love this clip point blade. Uh, it's hollow ground. And um, I'm excited about that because that's different from this. This is a full flat grind, and this is really incredibly keen as well. Uh, but I, I'm excited about the hollow grind here. Looks like a full height hollow grind. And with these uh, machined or nicely milled um, uh, slots there, I'm, I'm missing the word. Nail nicks slash, uh, what do you call it? Uh, fullers. Uh, you can really grab that blade nicely. I want to say thank you so much to Austin. He sent this to me 
and I really, really appreciate it. This is amazing. Um, I cannot wait to talk to him about this knife and other knives like the Ohio River Jack and, uh, and just talk about C. Reisner Cutlery, his grandfather, and the whole, uh, the whole operation. So uh, stay tuned for that. But in the meantime, you'll be seeing me uh, gush about this uh, on the show. All right. Thanks a lot.